Now to your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. One man is dead after a shooting in South Sacramento. It happened just after noon today. Sacramento police are now offering a reward for any information that leads to an arrest. The victim was only 25 years old. A 35-year-old man from Marysville has been arrested and charged with holding an 89-year-old woman at knife point and robbing her in Lincoln. He's being held on $90,000 bail. Police say he was found after he tried to use the victim's credit card at a local business. A 20-year-old has been arrested and charged with manslaughter for selling a woman drugs with fentanyl. It happened back in April of this year. The woman was found dead in a hotel room near Lodi. At least 100 cars were involved in a pileup crash early this morning near Denver. It comes after a storm left a few inches of snow on the highway. Several drivers and passengers did have minor injuries, but thankfully there are no reports of deaths. An indigenous group in Peru says they're holding nearly 100 tourists hostage, 23 of them foreigners, to draw the government's attention to complaints about oil pollution. None of the tourists have been harmed, and the group holding them says they'd allow them to continue their trip shortly. This was brought on by an oil spill back in September that impacted the community's ability to fish and their water supply. The United States added more than a quarter million jobs in October. Even so, the unemployment rate increased two-tenths of a percent, up to 3.7. The new job numbers also bring concerns the Fed could increase interest rates again soon. Billionaire Elon Musk says he is looking to cut Twitter's 7,500-person staff in half following his takeover of the tech company. He claims this is an effort to help the company turn a profit, something he's been critical about. A woman was attacked by a shark off Del Mar Beach, north of San Diego. Police say the woman was in her 60s and was swimming close to 200 yards offshore when she was bit. We're told the bite was not deep and lifeguards were on duty to help. A 14-year-old girl in San Diego has been named America's top young scientist. She won the 3M Young Scientist Challenge with a special pair of headphones that she invented. The headphones are designed to detect ear infections and help young people with hearing loss. The Powerball jackpot is officially the largest in history at $1.6 billion. 39 straight drawings have yielded no grand prize winner. The odds of winning any Powerball prize are about 1 in 25, while the odds of winning the jackpot, 1 in almost 300 million. And those are your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.